In this video, we will demonstrate how to terminate the Clearline SSF mechanical splice with SSF fiber installed in 900 micron fan out tubing. Clearline SSF field installable mechanical splices are fast and easy to terminate and are compatible with multi mode and single mode SSF fibers, as well as standard fiber optic cables. These are the tools you will need for this project the SSF mechanical splice installation tool the fiber optic cleaver adjusted for SSF fibers, fiber optic VFL with 2.5 and 1.25 mm adapter, fiber optic strippers, fiber optic cutting shears, and a pair of cutting pliers. Step 1. Remove the left and right covers from the mechanical splice, placing one on each leg of the cable to be joined, with arrows pointed towards the needed splice. Place a 900 micron buildup tube onto each of the two legs. Remove the left and right jacket sleeve rings from the assembly with a sharp edge and set aside. Remove the yellow splice with a sharp edge while avoiding touching fiber openings and place splice in tool. Slide each of the two assembly activator slides on the tool away from the center of the tool. Using only fingertips or nails, gently remove the soft peel colored 250 micron coating completely from the fiber. Do not use the fiber optic strippers during this step, as they can damage the SSF fibers polymer coating. Hold the fiber at a slight angle downward. Place the cable tubing at the 16 mm mark on the cleaver, laying in the appropriate groove of the cleaver for cable size. Ensure the fiber is straight, being at a 90 degree angle to the cleaver wheel. Close the cover on the cleaver and firmly push the cleave wheel forward. Repeat the previous cleaving process for the right cable fiber leg to be joined. If possible, plug VFL on the opposite end of one of the fibers being spliced for verification purposes. Insert the cleaved fiber into the left opening of splice by placing in the V groove at a slight angle and sliding forward until the jacket touches the side of the black splice holder. Insert cable under slide arm and place cable into foam holder so the cable lays straight. And slide the right fiber forward while watching for movement of the left fiber as it is pushed from within the splice and or loss of light if using a VFL. As soon as there is movement or loss of light, or both, maintain forward pressure with a bow in the cable and place the cable under the slide arm and into the foam cable holder. With both forward pressure and loss of light maintained if using VFL, slide each of the two slide arms towards the center, sliding the metal tabs until they touch each other to lock in the fibers. Carefully remove splice and fiber cable from tool. And place into splice assembly. Slide the build tube forward so it is located over the jacket sleeve windows on the assembly. Place the left jacket sleeve ring on the build tube while ensuring it is over the sleeve windows and the fiber can be laid straight. Squeeze the ring carefully with pliers if necessary to inset into place.
Repeat the same steps for the left side of the splice. Slide left and right splice covers, arrows positioned up, towards center to complete. For more information, visit the technical resource page at clearlinefiber.com.